point. Really, our, our primary mission is to enable you to get to exactly that. Be that when you use Google Apps, and you don't have to worry about administering email servers and so on, or when you use our cloud platform, where you don't have to worry about load balancing or, or global distribution or backups. Right? And so that is our mission. And with the cloud, this power can be distributed throughout your organization. So central IT is not an impediment to change, but actually the ultimate enabler of that change for all the teams uh, throughout your company. So I want to walk you through three examples of exactly how uh, this is happening today. First example is from Coca-Cola in the lead up to, today's, uh, to this year's uh, uh, World Cup. Um, they wanted to uh, engage with their users. And so they wanted to create an application that uh, allowed users to submit photos. And what you may not see in this picture is that this huge flag is composed of over 233,000 images that were picked from over 3 million images submitted by users in 200 countries across the world. Now, Coca-Cola, with their partner CINT, um, had only a few weeks to get this application up and running. So in just a few weeks, they built their entire platform on top of the Google Cloud platform. They used App Engine to handle the interactive parts, the uploading, and so on. The images were stored in cloud storage. The Compute Engine used the image manipulations that were needed to compose all of this together. And so even as millions of images were uploaded, the system didn't slow down because App Engine and Compute Engine are able to handle this load uh, very easily. And so with a very small team, Coca-Cola could create a compelling application in just a few weeks and get an ambitious project off the ground and really execute it flawlessly uh, as, as a, 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 you know, a wind up to, by the way, a great World Cup. I hope many of you watched, you, uh, watched it as well. It was one of my favorite World Cups, actually, because few games, were as, uh, uh, few games were boring and many games were as exciting as any game I've seen. Uh, 